<clears throat> That's actually just a replica. T-Rex's teeth were actually larger than your head. How big was a T-Rex? How big was a T-Rex? A T-Rex was huge. Um, six feet tall. What? A T-Rex was pretty big. His one toe would be my body. A T-Rex is as big as the Empire State Building. A T-Rex was big enough to relocate your house. Ah! Weight enough to step on your toe and make it hurt. Two tons. Humongous. A thousand pounds? 75,000 pounds. <laughs> so, you want to know how big a T-Rex was? Let's compare a T-Rex, one of the largest, most terrifying carnivores of its time, to the African elephant, the largest land mammal of today. Sue, the largest T-Rex skeleton ever found, was over 20 feet tall. That's as tall as a two-story building, but much shorter than a skyscraper. An African elephant is 10 to 12 feet at the shoulders, way shorter than a T-Rex. At 40 feet, Sue was longer than the width of a tennis court, but not as wide as a football field. At eight feet long, an elephant wouldn't make it halfway across the court. Sue is estimated to have weighed five to eight tons. That's less than a blue whale, but a lot more than a walrus. The average elephant weighs about seven to nine tons. So, although Sue the T-Rex definitely was longer and taller, the African elephant might be heavier. Oh, that's how big a T-Rex was. For a long time, we believed the T-Rex was the largest carnivorous dinosaur ever. Then, we discovered the Giganotosaurus and the Spinosaurus, and both were even bigger than the T-Rex. So, how'd I do? Leave a comment. Let me know. On the next episode of Your Kid Ask What? So you want to know how planes stay in the sky? Roger that.